Good evening, everyone. This is Linda. I hope you're having a great day today. Yeah. Listen, guys, it's been raining so much here until I have not been able to be outside. But I did put some clips together just to share with you all some things that I have been doing here in my car. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, y'all. But, but first, if you are not subscribed to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I will be sharing my Zone 9 garden. Yes. <laughs> It's been raining all night last night, all day today. Not a hard rain, just enough to keep you inside. But I've been busy, virtual. Yeah, I've been doing some things. Yeah, it's very exciting, very exciting. Who knew I could have all this fun sitting right here in my studio? <laughs> And I'm loving it, y'all. I'm loving it. <laughs> I'm going to get hooked to this stuff. <laughs> but listen, guys. Today, I just wanted to share with you all just some clips of some things that I did like yesterday and the day before. Uh, just to share with you some things that I had experienced here. You know, nothing huge, but something that will make you at least smile right hey guys this is linda so i'm in my bedroom and this is my view every morning yep this is the view from my bedroom window this is what i see y'all <laughs> so that right there that is my celery you see she's so tall she's such a tall girl over there Yep. It's my fig trees and the first light fat bucket. That's potatoes. Yeah. Gotta go all around over there and that's my onions and garlic and man, look at that dill. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. It's about the storm out there, y'all, so, hmm. Look at these here, daisies, they coming up real cute. And if I could go around here, yeah, you'll see, mm-hmm. Grow bags, and then big babies sitting right there. <laughs> yeah, but I just wanted to share, this is my view in the morning, huh? <laughs> All right. I can see Gloria's one of Gloria's little babies. I'm trying to stay way away from her so she won't fly away, but I see, that's her shadow, but that in the middle, that's just her little baby, one of them, she has two, beautiful Gloria, you're doing good Gloria, <laughs> hey guys, I'm back here at Wal Walgreens, and today is, um, what today is? Tuesday, um, April 13th. So today I'm taking my second dosage of, I'm taking the second dosage of Moderma uh, vaccine. Of course, you know, I've heard stories about the first dosage and yeah, I've heard stories about the second dosage that it's a doozy. So today, uh, you know, I'm gonna take my shot and then I'll keep you informed of how I feel. Right now, 
I'm feeling fine, fine, fine. <laughs> we'll see how it go later. All right, guys. Here we go. Let me pull up my sleeves here. Show y'all all my muscles. <laughs> all right. What's your name? Crystal. Crystal. All right, today we got Crystal. Now see, last time I got this shot, I didn't have no problems, Crystal. <laughs> we ain't had no problems. We ain't had no problems this time. All right, my baby. All right. All right. All right. All right. Have you had this shot? Not yet. What you mean, girl? But <laughs> <laughs> I'm highly thinking about getting it. Right. I don't know if it's food for me to get it. All right. Y'all saying y'all have great reservations on it? All right. Make me want to get it too. Okay. Hey. Like Are you a mommy? Yep, I'm a mommy. That's what makes me want to get it. Too. You know what's best for you and your family. Yep, I do. Baby, that was cool. <laughs> All, right. All right. I thank and you. And just say, did you sit for 15 minutes before you leave? But you already know that. Yeah. Yep. All, right. all right, my love. Thank all you. Right. I stopped in today because I wanted to share with you all how I feel about this second Moderma shot that I received for COVID. So the only thing I did feel is just the next day I felt like, yeah, I had a shot. And that is normal when you have a vaccination. So what I felt was very normal. And, of course, I heard a whole lot of stories. Ooh, cha! That second shot is a doozy. It's going to take you in. It had me in bed for three days. I shouldn't have took it. Well, I'm glad I took it because, guess what? I'm feeling fine, fine, fine. Yeah, no pain. Nothing. Nada. I feel just like the happy me that I am. Eventually, I'm going to have to make up my mind about who gets this barrel and who gets evicted. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It is about 7.20 in the evening, and I have one, well, there's more than one. <laughs> I didn't know it was this many. I knew it was, I thought it was two. But I think it's three um, uh, rhubarb, and it is three, and they are clumped together. Not that all. I don't like this, but yeah, they all hooked up on each other. <laughs> Look at that. That's not good. But she's all wrapped around her. Whoa, come on, girl. Let's see if I can get her through here. <laughs> all right. Maybe. <laughs> I think maybe I'm gonna leave them. I'm gonna leave two of them together because they are just too clumped together um, and you know what I'm going to leave them I'm going to leave them because they're just too too together so I'm just putting some of the soil that they are accustomed to back and yeah so Hopefully they will continue to do well over here because they just needed space. Okay. All right. Let me give them some water. And that's that. I will give them... Maybe I'll give them a little five and let them help them through the night. All right. So this is just all of my granulated fertilizers in the container. 
It should stop me from dragging bags, which I can't stand. <laughs> so, that's what that is. Yeah. So now I mixed up some five eleven. All right, so I have some five eleven here. Mmm. Y'all want a shot? <laughs> yeah. Bar. All right, guys. So I'm back over here by my onions and garlic. <laughs> so I was looking at this onion. You see that? Look at it splitting. So I'm just gonna go ahead on and take her because I'm cutting up seasoning today. Oh wow! She is rough in there. Oh, it is messy. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can turn it. There we go. Oh, man, it's so slippery. All right, guys, I'm going to have to put y'all down. <laughs> I wanted to lay this stalk of celery down so you can get a good idea of how long she is. So this is where I cut her, and this is how long this stark of celery is. That is huge. <laughs> that is huge. And the craziest thing is that she is not the longest. So to get her inside, I'm going to cut her a couple times, but I'm going to chop her up and put her in my seat. So that's that's all I need is one, y'all. <laughs> that's all I need is one. All right, family. So this is all my seasoning. I'm gonna cut up and put in the freezer bag, and I just use them when I need them. So it's garlic, it's one white onion, loads of bell peppers. This is onions, garlics, and leeks in here. That's what this is. And celery. Oh, I have parsley. <clears throat> yeah, parsley in there. Yeah, they in there. All right, so let's chop up some seasoning. Mmm. There it is. All chopped up. And now I'm going to mix it all up very well. And I'm going to put it in a uh, freezer bag. Yeah, but that's what it looked like. I'll show you what it looked like in the bag. Give me a minute. There they are. Both of them right there. One bag for Jody. Mm-hmm. This mine. This mine right here. <laughs> this mine. <laughs> You know, this is all my seasonings that I use in my meals. So I just have it all cut up and ready. And Jody takes hers and put hers in individual little small um, little plastic bag. But yeah, I don't do that. I just keep mine in this. But anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out. So this is um, chicken thighs, and I have about two wings I had in there so I put them off in here so what I'm going to do with these I've seasoned them they have um, all of my powders in it and um, I'm going to put this in the oven this way she going alright guys so this is my kohlrabi I am about to cut her up into cubes cubes <laughs> so guys that's my kohlrabi it have oil on it seasonings and yeah 
all that good stuff. And now I'm going to put it in the oven. I'm going to check on her for 20 minutes in 20 minutes just to see if it's soft to a fork can go in her. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. That's the cool wrapping. That's that one. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, guys. So this is my dinner. So this is some stewed chicken thighs with rice. And that is um, Creole tomatoes and lettuce. And kohlrabi. It's kohlrabi. <laughs> that is kohlrabi right there. And, yeah. I got my, uh, that's turf therapy, y'all. <laughs> this is my second bottle. I done cracked open. <laughs> Yeah, but anyway, so let's get the taste in this baby. Well, <laughs> but uh, I hope you all enjoyed. Um, this was really good. I mean, hey, I love, 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 love cooking my dinner. Mm, mm hmm. Well, let me say this I taste the kohlrabi and. Oh my God, it's so sweet. It has a sweetness to it. It's unbelievable. Mmm. -hmm. Mm -mm -mm. It's just so good. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. So, one thing I want to say is sometimes we want to try and let our vegetables, you know, we want our turnips and um, kohlrabis and all those root vegetables with big bottoms. We want them to get big, big bottoms, but listen, don't allow your vegetables to get too big, okay? Because they will get a little woody if you do that, so remember that. Mm-hmm. Um, this is a Creole tomato, y'all. Mm. Oh man, oh man. <laughs> All right, guys. Let me go. I'm gonna go do this. <laughs> I thank y'all for hanging out with me. All right, later, y'all.